crank angle position and engine RPM can be detected optically. A signal rotor plate is attached to the distributor shaft. It has 360 slits at one degree intervals on its outer edge. In board of the one degree slits are four slits, one for each cylinder. They provide the reference points for the ignition timing and the fuel injection. One is larger than the others to provide the signature effect for the number one cylinder. As the rotor plate turns, it passes between two sets of diodes positioned in line with the slits. The diodes above the rotor plate are light emitting diodes, while the ones below are photodiodes. When provided with a suitable voltage, light emitting diodes transmit a fine beam of light. Photodiodes receive this light and use it to make a voltage output signal. When a slit is in alignment, the light beam passes through and a signal is transmitted to the control unit. When the slit is out of alignment, the light beam is interrupted and the signal falls to zero. The control unit uses the interruption of the light beam and the one degree slits to gauge engine RPM. It uses the interruption of the light beam and the signature slit to gauge the position of the number one piston. All of this data is used to keep close control of ignition timing and fuel injection.